you head out for your vacation this summer, be vigilant about checking for bed bugs. Got to do it. Pest Control Professionals report that a majority of their business is treating hotels. Tonight, WAT 600 Consumer Reporter Don Dare talks to the professional who shares some tips yeah. on really what to look for. Well, you know, bed bugs can be found anywhere from a luxury hotel to a summer camp, and you'll see that here in a moment. Imagine you're on that vacation that you look forward to only to wake up your first morning covered in bed bug bites. Been there, done that, and it wasn't very pleasant. You know, the insects are so tiny they're difficult to see, but do they pack a wallop of a bite? When I was getting there up um, Tuesday morning, I found the bug crawling right there up above her bed, and it was a live bug. This is what a squashed bed bug looks like and that's blood. Then when you touch them, it's almost like they explode with the blood. Experts say bed bugs like to hide out in mattresses near the bedboards. Dr. Brittany Campbell is an entomologist. She studies insects for the National Pest Management Association. We found that 97 percent of pest control professionals were treating for bed bugs in the United States. Where can they be found? They can be found, I know this is surprising, but essentially anywhere inside of a home. They will bite you, so their bites cause allergic reactions, so they can cause skin reactions. Everyone's immune system is different, uh, but you can have an allergic reaction. In severe mm. cases, those reactions can create blisters. Dr. Campbell says bed bugs are resilient creatures, and they've developed a resistance to some of the pesticides we have in the market now. They're very difficult to control yourself, so I really encourage you to reach out to a professional. And I mean, they're just tiny little things. Mark Nadowski with Russell's Pest Control says bed bugs hide in the smallest places in and around beds and box springs, and killing them isn't easy. Well, the surefire way now seems to be heat. If we can get the temperature of a facility up above 105 degrees and hold that for, for some time, we can kill the eggs, kill the nymphs, and kill the adults. There are some sprays that are, that are labeled for bed bugs, and they seem to be, they work fairly well. For those planning vacations and they want to be on the lookout for bed bugs, what should they do when they get to their room? So I would really encourage you to first go to the bed. You can pull back the sheets, um, get all the way down to the mattress, and look in the mattress seams. That's where bed bugs are going to hide. If you find bed bugs in your room while on vacation, take a picture of them to show to the manager and insist on another room. And if you think you have brought the bed bugs home with you from vacation, again, it's best to get a professional to help zap the invitation, infestation of these little critters. And Kristen and Bo, as many have experienced in trying to fight bed bugs, they are not do-it-yourself little critters. You can't spray them, yeah. especially mm -hmm. if there's a whole bunch of them. Go get a professional. It's not easy, that now is for sure. Now my skin's crawling. I know. Don. <laughs> Great. Mm. Don, thank yes. you. Hey, if you have a consumer question for Don, send him an email at ddarrettwat.com. You can also call his uh, six on your side hotline number, 865-633-5974.